Their kids were hit in a car crash. Four of them, two of them, Rob and Reed, were paralyzed. The Rumpies didn't know them. They went to the same church they never met before. Mitt asked me to come over on Christmas. He brought his boys, his wife, and gifts. Later on, he said, by continuing that tax cut, we'll get an additional $500 billion in tax relief in the next 10 years, and their income is an average of $8 million. We want to extend permanently the middle class tax cut for permanent, from the Bush middle class tax cut. These guys won't allow us to. You know what they're saying? We say, let's have a vote. Let's have a vote on the middle class tax cut, and let's have a vote on the upper tax cut. Let's go ahead and vote on it. They're saying no. They're holding hostage the middle class tax cut to the super wealthy. And on top of that, they got another tax cut coming. Right That's on. $5 trillion that all the studies point out will in fact yeah. give another $250 million, or, uh, yeah, $250,000 a year to those 120,000 families and raise taxes for people who are middle income with a child by $2,000 a year. This is unconscionable. There is no need for this. The middle class got knocked on their heels. The Great Recession crushed them. They need some help now. The last people who need help are 120,000 families for another, another $500 billion tax cut over the next 10 years. I hate to say I told you so. I think I Biden won the debate. So you know what? So they keep a minute like here we are at the end of the uh, Biden uh, uh, Ryan debate. Okay, oh, no, I'm, 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 I'm just right now, each one. These, these are okay, and I'll tell you something. Two dollar fifty dollar drinks. These are two fifty dollar drinks.